there was a black hole that swallowed the universe. Written by Chris Ferry. Illustrated by Susan Batori. There was a black hole that swallowed the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a galaxy. It left quite a cavity after swallowing that galaxy. It swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a star. It couldn't get far, that bright shining star. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. It swallowed the galaxies that filled up the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a planet. Very organic, this fine looking planet. It swallowed the planets that orbited the stars. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. It swallowed the galaxies that filled up the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a cell. It might get unwell after swallowing a cell. It swallowed the cells that gave life to the planets. It swallowed the planets that orbited the stars. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. It swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a molecule. It thought it was fuel, a big molecule. It swallowed the molecules that fed the cells. It swallowed the cells that gave life to the planets. It swallowed the planets that orbited the stars. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. It swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed an atom. It's hard to get at them, those tiny atoms. It swallowed the atoms that built up the molecules. It swallowed the molecules that fed the cells. It swallowed the cells that gave life to the planets. It swallowed the planets that orbited the stars. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. It swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a neutron. A good start to build on. A neutral neutron. It swallowed the neutrons that stabled the atoms. It swallowed the atoms that built up the molecules. It swallowed the molecules that fed the cells. It swallowed the cells that gave life to the planets. It swallowed the planets that orbited the stars. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. It swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole 
that swallowed a quark. And that's all there was. And now it is dark. At the back of the book here, we have some stellar black hole facts. So number one is you can't see a black hole because it doesn't reflect light. It actually pulls light in with its immense gravity. Uh, number two is the place beyond which nothing can escape a black hole is called the event horizon. Number three is the center of the black hole is called a singularity. We might never know what happens there. Number four is black holes warp space and time around them. To us, time appears to move much slower near a black hole. Number five is when two black holes collide, they send out waves of energy that stretch and squish space itself. And number six, scientists believe there is a huge black hole at the center of every spiral galaxy, including our own Milky Way. Thanks for listening and don't forget to subscribe. Want to check out the last story we read? Here's the link. Do you have a favorite book you want read aloud? Leave it in the comments below.